hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is esther of estibella designs so you are welcome to the sewing process of our six pieces blouse so in the previous video we drafted this pattern and in this video we are going to be sewing it if you haven't watched the drafting process i'll drop the link in the description box so that you can go check it out this is just the sewing process so i have pressed my hair stay i've cut my lining and pressed my hair stay you can see it on everything then let me show you how i pressed my wording you can see the way i pressed my wording this is for the side front you can see the way i pressed it it stopped at the under bust and i curved it like this you see it then let me show you the one for the center front this is the one for the center front you can see the way i pressed it i did not allow my wording get to this one inch you know this one inch is for the zipper allowance zipper will be here so my wording did not enter inside this one inch but it stopped at the under bust and look at where it started from it started half inch below the neckline then it stopped at the under bust you see it don't let it get into your zipper allowance so start sewing whatever i do on the fashion fabric that's exactly what i'll do on the lining piece this is the center front this is the side front so i'll go to my sewing machine and sew so from make sure you stop sew, sew from below and make sure you have not your half length and your under bust so that they can align so i'll sew it like this sew it like this then i'll sew for the back too center back I'm just going to hold it by half inch because there will not be zipper there. Then I'll join this to this and join this to this. This is the side back. I'll join it. So I'll do the same thing exactly like this on the lining piece. Okay, guys. So this is the front. You can see I've padded it. I've sewn it. This is the inside. So you can see it. This is the other part. So this is what it looks like. You know the center front. There's going to be zipper. So I did the same thing for the back. I joined the back. So this is the back. Please take note, anything I do for the lining, anything I do for the fashion fabric, that's what I did for the lining too. So this is the back. You can see it. So the next thing to do now is to close this back with half inch to make it one piece. You know we left half inch allowance. So I'm going to close this by half inch so that this back, back piece will become one for the front what i'll do is to fix my zipper on the fabric alone i'll fix my zipper this is the fabric so i'll fix my zipper on this part and fix it, this one too on this part so the zipper will be the one connecting them on this alone then i'll use the lining to turn it i'll show you how to use the lining to turn it okay guys see i've sewn the zipper today to the fashion fabric you can see how it's looking it's looking very beautiful i must tell you <laughs> so what what i'll do next is to open up my zipper like this separate them then i'll open up this zipper allowance then i'll bring my lining piece look at my lining piece i'll put it over it you see it? i'll put it over it right side facing right side then i'll sew the neckline I'll sew the neckline. Then I'll sew close to the zipper teeth on this zipper allowance area. I'm going to sew close to the zipper teeth. I'll hold them together. Then I'll also sew half inch below. The hemline, yeah. I'll sew half inch. So I'm sewing, yeah, half inch below the hemline. I'm sewing the zipper. I'm sewing on the zipper. That means the zipper is in between the fashion fabric and the lining. You see it. I'll sew close to the tip, but not very close. Then I'll sew the neckline i'll do the same thing for this one too you see it i'll do the same thing the neckline the zipper and the hemline so let me do that and for the back all you need to do is to this is the right side of the fashion fabric and this is the right side of the lining just place them over each other then you sew the neckline i'll sew only the neckline and i'll sew the hemline i'll sew below the hemline and the neckline that's all then i'll turn it after sewing all the part I asked you to sew, this is what it should look like. Then you cut off the you cut off the zipper, the excess zipper upward. You cut it off. Then you notch your neckline. You notch it. Then you turn it to the other side. When you turn it to the other side, this is what you have. This is the other part of it. I've already turned it. I've pressed it. You can see this is what it should be. So when I press this one to 
this is what it should look like so let me just i've not pressed it but let's just turn it so that we'll see what everything looks like so by the time i'll press this one too this is what it should look like and when you zip up this is what it should look like so this is the front then this is the back i've also pressed the back and i turned it to the right side you see it's this is the lining and this is fashion fabric so i've pressed it so what the next thing we we'll do is to bring them together you know we're doing it finishing so the next thing you do is to bring them together you join them by the shoulders here so i'll go to my machine and i'll join them by the shoulder you know the way we join shoulder now so i'll turn it like this then i'll sew the shoulder i'll do the same thing for this shoulder then for me to join the bodies this is what i'll do i'll remove the lining and i'll bring only the fashion fabric like this i'll fix in my measurements so you put in your bust measurements your waist measurement and the hem the hem does not really have measurements you just from the waist measurement you just take it like you just take it like a line so i'll put in my bust measurement my waist measurement and i'll just sew it like this so what you do after sewing just look at what i want to show you after sewing like this on the fabric when you get to this end you just continue with the lining you would have measured the lining too whatever you used on the fabric just you can remove quarter of an inch so that the lining will have room a little room so you just sew like this you enter into the lining you see it and you stop at the ammo of the lining you see it that means you are taking one straight stitch from the fabric you see it will start from the ammo of the fabric we'll go down to the hem then we'll enter into the lining i hope you can see what i'm doing we'll enter into the lining that's how we we'll do it so i'll shape here i'll shape the other side and i'll show you what it looks like i hope you understand that explanation so after joining the sides this is what you should have you see it everything neatly finished I've gone ahead to fix my sleeve to just fix any sleeve of your choice you see it see how beautiful the inside is looking can you see it so I'll just use my serger to serge the ammo where I fixed the sleeve and that's all you can see our six pieces blouse is done and is looking beautiful so this brings us to the end of this tutorial i hope you have found value in this video if you do please give it a thumbs up and share this video thank you so much for joining me i really appreciate you for always coming back to watch my videos thank you so much i'll see you in my next video bye